as um, I have invited um, one of the top, 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 top Shopee sellers, and she is also a certified Shopee and Lazada trainer. And um, yeah, it is pretty interesting. Actually, I am looking for um, Shopee coaches or someone that is very king, uh, very king, very powerful uh, in uh, in Shopee or in any e-commerce. So I I stumbled upon um, Kong. And then um, I just asked her, uh, so um, Kong, uh, uh, what sort of things that you know that you, you can share? Then she says, uh, I can share whatever you know about Shopee. Then I say something, uh, I asked, uh, you know, Kong, can you share a bit on Shopee ads? And then she says, Wink, um, yes, Shopee ads are definitely something that um, she's good at and she can share. But the thing is that she has better things to offer to all of you guys, which she will share her tricks, you know, um, that she used to drive traffic to her Shopee store without spending on ads. Just a brief introduction about um, who she is before I invite her to this live, you know, and uh, um, share more knowledge with you guys. So help me to share this live to your friends as well, okay? Those of, you know, your friends that want to start Shopee, I want to start selling in Shopee, but um, do not know how actually to share, I mean, not to share, to sell or how to set it up, you know, share this live to him or her or tag her name, his name in this live. All right. So just a brief introduction um, who actually is Kong. So Kong is an e-commerce coach and a Lazada certified trainer. So she is a self-made online entrepreneur who started from zero and she is one of the top and uh, one of her top selling stock is actually Big K Mart. I mean, you guys can um, um, look at it in Shopee and has 57,000 followers, is, if I'm not mistaken. She, also, she is also a pharmacist and a mom of three active kids. So her passion is actually um, helping people to become, success, to become a successful online entrepreneur, just like herself. And um, Kong does um, conduct regular trainings via Lazada universities, business seminars, her website and also her own private coaching class All right so today's topic is super important and um, i think not much of coaches will share these tricks with you guys as well you know how actually you can drive traffic to your shopee store without ads i mean you can get a lot of um, information out there um coaches um trainers they are selling their course how to make money or you know how to drive traffic um uh, um, to your Shopee store by using ads. So today we do a bit of difference, how to drive traffic to your Shopee store without ads. Already? So make sure that you share this live to your friends or tag your friends that want to actually start up um, a Shopee business. Already? So without wasting your time, let us invite Gong to the show. Hi Gong, how are you? Hi. Hi. Back, so yeah. Today is all about how to get traffic to your products and your store without ads. Okay. Um, I know that you all have been told when you first started selling in Shopee or even Lazada that, oh, without ads, you will, won't make it. Okay. So then you all will like, oh, cannot, cannot. I need to pump in a lot of ads money. And then, but the most basic Thing actually you need to do first which is the conversion of your own products okay before you really start on ads i'm not saying that ads is not good i'm not saying that i never ever do ads before okay but it's just that um i hardly spend less than maybe zero point something percent on just ads because most of my things are actually from organic traffic so let me introduce myself first Okay, and then uh, I will answer all your questions. Okay, please prepare all your questions for me. I want to answer all your questions and I want to see some of your stores. You all can send in a links of your stores. You, if you want me to have a look live on today's uh, YouTube and also Facebook. Okay, so let me introduce myself. I am Kong. Okay, I'm a Lazada certified trainer and I'm a pharmacist and working pharmacist, huh? And I'm also a online entrepreneur. Okay, and my one of my shops is a big camart. Okay, it's a health, beauty, grocery, and baby store, and I have uh three very very active, very active. Oh my god, three very active kids, and I'm also um since I followed uh Wing Hong and I see him wow very, so mangat make YouTube. So I also have uh YouTube channels um 
under health is Big Camp Mart and now it's a lot of, I'm sharing a lot of Shopee and Lazada tips on my Kongpreneur channel. So this is my QR code if you want to follow me. Uh, please uh, subscribe to my channel and you will learn a lot of things on how to grow yourselves. Okay, so uh, let's get right into the how to get traffic without ads. Okay, so uh, maybe you all can share with me that uh, whether uh, you're using ads right now in your store to drive sales, okay? And uh, roughly how much of a percentage that uh, you're using uh, of your store, um, what do you call that? Your store margins or your product price. Okay, I, I actually have... Um, a lot of students come to me, they are newbies and they already burned 3,000 ringgit just on ads alone. Okay, so uh, Felina say 10%. Uh. <laughs> okay, so uh, Felina 10% you consider very good already because a lot of my students actually when they come to me, they already burn like 3,000 per month just on uh, ads alone. And some tell me 30%, some tell me 50% of their, uh, the product price. So, but I think the most important, the most very, very important, you need to uh, settle, okay, Kautim your own store conversion first before you pump a lot, a lot of money on ads. If not, you really, really burn money one, okay? So, how to get traffic without ads, okay? This is how I do it, lah, okay? So, most uh, uh, different people will teach you different things, but this is exactly how I do it for my own store. In my uh, big camera store in Shopee, I got around 50 something thousand followers. In Lazada, I last checked, I think it's around 85 to 86 thousand followers in Lazada. Okay, so for me, very, very important your titles and keywords are your main traffic because people will actually go and search. Okay, for example, uh, Wing, he want to buy the big specs. Okay, he want to change, not blue, he boring. He want to change to red color. So then he will type in big specs, right? But most of the people, um, if you spelling uh, spectacles, but most people are searching specs only, but you don't have the word specs on your title, right? When people search, you cannot find. Okay, so these are the main traffic drivers. There are a lot of um, new sellers they don't know that they need to give the titles what people are searching for but they just simply give one title that they think you know they will just simply put here yeah, so but high search keywords are the very very important and then um your images okay you know now right come that uh in shopee there's so many competitors right so when there are so many 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 competitors and so many chun chun image right which are you going to click on okay that is the most important traffic driver, okay? So even though that you your competitor paid a lot of money on ads on top, okay? But what you what if you're number, you're at the bottom, somewhere in the middle, but your image is much, much better than the one who paid for ads. So people will click on you. So these are the two main traffic drivers that will come to your store, okay? And remember, keep all your questions for me. It's a very short presentation only and I will be answering most of your questions after this, okay? And one of the main, main traffic drivers that you can do totally without ads is just to um, have a very, very competitive price. So competitive price is, okay, let's say that you jitter jitter, you want to untung banyak, okay? Uh, let's say that you say every item I need to untung 50 ringgit, okay? But then most of the sellers are actually just selling like untung 10 ringgit from that particular item. So if you can just bring down a little bit your price and make yourself on the first page, you don't want need to pay for ads already. Okay, so you need to really um, be competitive in your price. Then the it will be a natural traffic driver to your store. I'm not saying the rugis, do, rugi jual, please. Uh. Don't rugi jual, but be competitive in your price. Okay, so Elwin, I noticed uh, some of the comments say Elwin say around 30% he's using on his ads. So that's actually quite a lot. Lah. Okay, so and then um, what about uh, products? Okay, a lot of sellers, they come to me and then they say, oh, I only have three products. I want to make 100,000 sales. So three products, 100,000 sales, um, 
I mean, do you think it's possible? <laughs> Uh, can not give us pro- products la. It's very high <laughs> high price I think can la. yeah unless that you selling one item is 30,000 okay so I think it's quite impossible so um, you need to grow more at least like around 30 SKU 50 SKU 100 SKU to get more uh, traffic because if, imagine if one item got 50 traffic or 100 traffic if 10 items already got 1,000 traffic if 100 items already how many traffic there is to your store so we that the traffic comes from accumulative okay semakin bertambah okay so and then a lot of uh people when they go to your shop right then you don't want decorate no banner nothing's not professional then they lari so but when you get people who want to view your products they a lot of kepo chi ah, want to go into your shop one no so when they go into your shop, uh, wow, they say, wow, so professional. Then they end up buying two or three items. That's where the additional traffic comes from. So not that everything is as 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 You settle your house, cantik cantik. You settle your products, cantik cantik. Before you do your ads, then you don't burn money. Oh, I see Sherin come in already, ha? Huh? Sherin, Shopee expert. Okay, so um. Uh, and then let's uh, go to one of the major traffic drivers, which is campaigns. So during like 10, 10, 9, 9, 11, 11, please, if possible, if you got chance, join every single campaign you can find. Because during campaigns, if you will get like 100 or 1000 times traffic from your normal days without paying campaigns you no need to pay money one okay just that you need to give maybe like a three percent four percent five percent cheaper than your normal price so all this no need money thing you please join and drive traffic to your products okay and okay there are you know uh are you doing any feed any shopee sellers here that are actually doing feed right now every week Rajin or not, okay, you need to do weekly or even daily feed posts, okay. Actually, you can share from your Instagram to your uh, feed also, okay. And then um, try to increase your followers by chatting them, those that who buy from you before and requesting them to follow you. Don't paksa, okay. Don't, don't force yourself. Don't force them to follow you, okay. So all this... The more followers you have, every time you launch a new product or you post something, they may click on it, okay? And being a follower or being a feed, the click, no need money, one free. So all this is without paying what extra ads money or things that is totally free that you can do it on your own, okay? And if you're there, okay? A lot of people, oh, yo, I sell it, I'm malu. I'm malu, I don't show my face. But live, during live, right? If you can do your first life, you can do your second life already. You need to get over the first barrier. Doing choppy life, right? A lot of new people who never ever see you before suddenly will come to and see you. Then all you have to do is say, oh, follow me, follow me, f- point up to the follow button, right? And then the people will follow you. And then, or they even click on the products that you showcase on that day. So totally free things, okay? You don't need to pay for any Shopee life. And always share your products on your Facebook, YouTube, or even some people now, a lot of my uh, students, they're doing TikTok, okay? So, uh, Wing, you start your TikTok already, ah? Tak ada masa, oh. Oh, sila mudah, no? But we will, I will do it, yeah. Well, drive traffic back to your store or your products that you can have links there. So all this, right, is super, 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 super important that a lot of people will think, oh, I, I don't care about this. I think I'll pay ads and I'll be the king of Shopee or king of Lazada. Actually, it's not true. You need to settle every single, all the tricks I told you here first before you uh, can go on to your ads, if possible. Okay? So very, very important. Always, okay, uh, balance your margins versus your sales. I know that you want to untung 1,000, 10,000 per product, okay? But then if your all your competitors are selling steep, cheaper than you, you will never ever be on the first page. And even if you put $1 million ads, if you're more $1,000 more expensive than your competitor, people click, nobody buy. So there's no conversion, okay? So you end up, people click, 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 click and nobody buy. Okay, and always remember the titles, key, uh, keywords, and your image. You need to improve 
before you start doing your ads. Okay. And always try to get more reviews so that people, when they click, they see, oh, got people review. Okay, straight away, I want to buy. So it's ads. Remember, guys, very, very important. Okay. Ads is click. Conversion to sell. People want to take their money and pay to you is conversion, which you need to go and do yourself. Okay. Ads do not confirm you sales. Ads only bring you traffic, but to convert to sales, do the kung fu is up to you. Okay. So, and always, always very important to all sellers, especially new sellers, old sellers, don't give up on your e commerce journey. E commerce is the future of uh, sales in Malaysia. Okay. So, um, that's it. Uh, almost for me. Uh, okay. I share a lot of tips to all the Lazada and Shopee sellers, especially in Malaysia, to grow your sales.